you've turned on to rock and roll. Oh, <laughs> Sensei is gonna <laughs> kill me. <laughs> Just, <laughs> oh man. And it, <laughs> my, my, I still think one of my favorite like hidden gems is the whole thing in um Black Sheep, where he's like Officer Mihoff, Jack. <laughs> yeah. Get out of here. <laughs> David Spade's in the back like, yeah, I got it. <laughs> and the way he just looks at David, get in the back. And like <laughs> oh, man. <sighs> what do we have tonight? All right. We got we have Tom, Tom McDonald. McDonald scars. Okay. New um, song. This actually looks like it may be a little more mellow as far as like a beat yeah um especially because it could um, be wrong what could i'm be gangsters well, fuck. Uh, it's it's not pulled up yet guys but what we can see down here on the screen is that uh he's got an acoustic guitar next to him with what looks like a uh, photo album of sorts he so does have some um, cowboy boots on um, yeah okay so maybe we're gonna go with a different genre thing here I yeah mean, I mean, it's we just, might um kind of like with uh the deer alcohol thing with that with uh dax is yeah. that you know it was like whoa this is completely different so 100 i don't know different. if that's what's gonna happen here but well, yeah. I say, why don't we just go ahead and stop quoting movies from Chris Farley and, and David Spade? <laughs> yeah, and go ahead and just do the intro and get started. Let's do it. All right. Welcome back, you music junkies. I'm Eric. I'm the hip hop head. I'm Kyle. I'm the metal head. And we're brothers that react to shit. So let's do that. Tonight, we have a new Tom McDonald Scars. This looks really interesting. This might be a different side to him. So why don't we just go ahead and yeah. get started? I'm just going to pull it up, make it happen. Mr. McDonald never lets us down. Yeah. So, all right. Let's go. Oh, hell yes. Don't remember how I got all these scars, but I know I lived a hell of a life. Mm. Oh. I can't remember how I made it this far, but I know it was a hell of a fight. This that is, was good. This oh, is cool. Okay. I, I'm, I'm feeling the message. I'm, I'm hearing the vibe. This is, uh, I mean, because we know he can sing, but yeah. getting to kind of hear like a stripped down version of him yes. is, is really, uh, maybe this will build, but. Uh, right, but still, at least for now. Yeah, this is, right. I'm. I'm okay, that, that line was just hard, though, so okay. Uh, by the way, Mom also messaged me and said she listened to this before she watched the reactions. So Damn it, Mom! She's, she's, no, but, she, dude, she loves Tom McDonald. I know, so I it's, know. it's just so cool. Like it's, She's like, couldn't wait. I'm like, I don't blame you. So, <laughs> <it's> like, <laughs> all right, all right, let's yep. go. And remember how I made it this far, but I know it was a hell of a fight. Could have been some bones in a coffin stone, drinking vodka locked mm. up with the bros, causing problems broke at the bottom. You know that I... Got a lot of marks under these clothes Should've killed me somehow I survived These tattoos <laughs> are my arm Hide from you All the scars Okay, wow. Okay, so two things. Yeah. Very interesting that he states that is um, not that I do that, mm -hmm. like as far as like cutting or if maybe something like that. Maybe that's what he's talking about. It's never but, been your thing. But right. but he's he could also be talking about something else, too, is that tattoos are a therapy. Mm. It's a hurt that you're doing on purpose. And it it's kind of like it's one of those things that like a lot of people that get tattoos that is part of the like ritual. Mm is the pain and it's for one purpose or another for whoever you are but like right he could he's talking about both but that was interesting because i don't know maybe he was a cutter and that's what he's talking about or yeah. it could just be covering myself up for, with these scars that just in general that yeah. i've gained over the years whether and his art his, was his therapy, right? I mean, whether it was done to cover up something physical or a, you yes. know, because uh, I mean, yes. it's, it's not the first time that we've heard the mentality of. Sorry, like, I was not, trying to explain that, right? Yeah, yeah, no, 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 you're good. Um, it's you know, like not all scars are physical, mm -hmm, and it's, mm -hmm. it's one of those where it's like, again, this is not the first time we've That's heard what this. I was trying to say, but I like what he's doing with this. this I do is, too. This is really cool. I and do I, too. I, I'm loving that he's wearing a corn shirt as well. So that that's, yeah. that's pretty wild. So yeah, all right, let's go. Let's go back. <laughs> yeah. Um, I just so yeah, that's just very interesting. That <clears throat> that's mm, okay. Yeah. This is good. That was, I like that. All the scars, these on my arm, from you. All the scars. I don't remember how I ended up here, but I know I probably should have died. Oh, oh. I 
Um, you remember when I said uh, NF, how does he know? Um, I literally just had this uh, come to earth moment a couple of days ago of like, you know, my thought life doing what it was. And I just kind of sat down. I, I looked at what was around me mm-hmm. and I was just like, look, man, you got a vehicle that works. Mm. You got a job. You have food on the table. You have a home. You have a home. You know, you have family that loves you. You have all these things. It's you're not doing too bad. Right. Um, sometimes you don't have that much in that plentiful, you know, amount to be able to <clears throat> lean on. But even in those moments when it's like you start just focusing just on little wins. Yeah. Just to keep you going. Um, yeah. This was wow. like, like Kevin said in the office. It's just nice to win one. Yeah. yeah. But yeah. that's. I love this chorus too. This this, I, this is this is really nice. I'm really digging <laughs> this, man. You know, Dax went country, and I mean, I wouldn't say he's going no, country, but, but he's, he's doing something different. He's you know? flipping a little bit here, and I'm really here for it. Mm-hmm. But I know I probably should have died. I don't remember why I cried all those tears, but I know that I turned out all right. I know that people wanted me dead. I lost all my friends. Was running from the cops, getting bread. Seen a lot of things in all of my years, but I'm thankful for this crazy life. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> every single scar and every single scrape, every bruise and tattoo along the way tells a little story that I can't explain because the words escape me, but the marks remain. <sighs> the words escape me, but the marks remain. Mm. I had you know that I have seen a lot of things in all of my years, but I'm thankful for this crazy life. Oh yeah. Every single scar and every single scrape, every bruise and tattoo along the way tells a little story that I can't explain because the words escape me, but the marks remain. They won't ever fade and they can't be erased. They made me who I am and I am not ashamed. Every bump and scratch and every drop of blood prove how far I've came. These tattoos. Big facts, dude. Absolutely. Love the smoke. It's uh, it's pretty sick, actually. I have had my scars longer than most of my friends. Mm. A couple cars, put some stitches in my legs. Whoa! Looked up at the stars, and all I can say is thanks. Mm. Recovery was hard. Good for you, dude. I know it was hard. It was easy in my legs. Wow. Look up at the stars and all I can say is thanks. Recovery was hard, but it made me who I am. Mm. All these ugly battle scars complete me. They're reminders of the demons who tried their best to defeat me. They Ooh. all look so good in photos, but my struggles ain't beneath me. And these tattoos ain't for nothing. This is physical graffiti. Every broken bone, all the sticks and stones, and the moments when I felt so alone. Every single tear and like a million beers that I only drank so I could try to cope. Every bloody nose. And then this is physical graffiti. Every broken bone, all the sticks and stones, and the moments when I felt so alone. Every single tear and like a million beers that I only drank so I could try to cope. Every bloody nose and all the muddy clothes when I was in the dirt down inside a hole. Every single scuff and every single scab made me who I am. <laughs> Just good, dude. <laughs> yeah. Like this is I, God. How does he do it every time? Mm. Oh, listen to him in the background. He's got so many. That was sick. A video by Nova. How Nova? You are, you are just so good. Just doing this stuff. Um, okay. Um, we've said it before, but uh, we we do multiple reactions in one night. Shocker. Uh, that's that's how. We <gasps> yeah. Oh, you know, it's like, wait, how, why do you guys look different? Well, wardrobe. So wardrobe <laughs> changed because we're cool. <laughs> like, it's just us going in another room and putting on a different <laughs> yeah. shirt. Right. It's not like we have somebody going here. Here, makeup. No. Uh, uh, First, we need Chauncey because we still even have our pause boy. <laughs> um, we're going through the NF journey right now. 
and uh, we did the two songs that are up mm-hmm. next. We did those before this, and uh, we didn't know what to expect uh, with Tom. And uh, tonight has been a heavy night in general. What I will say this is was that a fuck day for me to have to do this, I, I, dude. I get it. And what what I love about this though is that this was an uplifting song. Like it's you know it's it that was it it's, was um sometimes being honest about where you've been um and you know just the idea of like i don't know if this happens to anybody else or like how this works with you know anybody else's stuff like you know thought life but uh when certain things come back to me when i'm thinking about stuff that's either happened to me mm-hmm. or you know like you know the stuff i've experienced secondhand or whatever um I've really kind of learned to Hank Hill it, you know, just see, when he looks at, uh, you know, Brittany Murphy's character, you know, he's like, oh, Lou Anne, where he's just like, no, he's like, if you ever feel sick, just, just yeah. take it down, you know, yeah. it's like, he's like, yeah. you'll be fine. And, you know, that's, I mean, it's a joke, but in the same hand, like, no, like, that's not good to do. Like, you know, you have to deal with this stuff and do just you know? like, it's, but yeah. it's, but in the same, <laughs> in the same, do they, do we though? Um, In the same hand is that being able to see somebody that, you know, is being very real about, you know, like, look, this shit did happen to me. It was horrible. Mm -hmm. Um, I hated every second of it, but it's something I relate to very much is that, you know, in the end, I wouldn't change it because it made me who I am. I'm going to have you react to something then. Um, It's probably not going to get a lot of views and I don't care, Mm -hmm. Um, but it's it's similar to this and it's the K Reno. The struggle made me great. Mm. Okay. Ooh, that song is fire. Yeah. So that it's it's got a very similar feel, um, but they're just kind of wording it differently, like how, how like with their journey. Yeah. But yeah, it was just it was nice to hear kind of a an uplifting kind of thing from him. I mean, because I mean, Tom has always been very positive. He in is, his music, but, but he's also bold. Yes. So and, it's like, it's that type of thing. And yeah. he didn't get like political or anything like this was a, like you said, this was just him being vulnerable. Yeah. And I think that's what was really nice about it. And then that more mellow side of him, as far as like, you know, the beat, the sound. And then he did kind of, he, he brought it kind of hard there for a minute. He did. And then, did. you know, it's just, it was one of those where it's like, it was a nice mixture of him. And yeah. I really hope we get more of things like this from him in the future. Maybe not like a complete album, but I want an, I want more things and want to know more of what he can do of things like this. It's kind of like Corey doing Stone Sour and you hear Bother where yeah. it's like, dude, do more do slow more stuff. Do more of this. Yeah, it's like, I love your heavy stuff. I like, you know, I yes. found you for a reason. I listened to that stuff on repeat, but give me a little more of this window. Yes. I, like, I want to know what else is here. Correct. You know, so, and yeah. that's where, so yeah, yeah. this is, th- this was really good. Yeah. Um, I'm, I'm. Mad that mom got to hear it before me. <laughs> uh, I'm not gonna let that shit go. But uh, it makes yeah. sense though. She, I mean, she didn't lie. I mean, this is yeah. this was great. So, this is, man, thank you. Tom. I say yes. Thank you, Tom. If you yes. do happen to see this one day, but thank you. Um, I say if they liked what they saw, you hit the like button, subscribe. That way you never miss an upload. And watch us two idiots react to stuff. And comment down below if you want to see anything else. And we'll get to it as soon as we can. And we'll see you next time, guys. Cheers. Adios.